Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today I'm going to be showing you guys all of the M Cosmetics lip glosses that came in their volume three box. And I'm really excited about this because I've been in the market for lip glosses that don't have shimmer in them. So I decided to get this set and then I also got a mini, what is it called? <laughs> Infinite Lip Cloud, yes. I have one of their Infinite Lip Clouds in Muted Mauve, so I'm really excited to see how Faded Clementine looks on me. So here it is, you get five inside. You've probably seen if you were interested already. And I already put one of them on and I wiped it off. It came off really easily, so that's why I decided to do this video for you guys. This set is, I believe, $35, I think. So I think that's a really good deal. And I'm really all about mini lip gloss or mini makeup products in general because I hardly go through, you know, full size. So I'm going to take all these out. They are very tightly packed and they have a nice velvety tube. I'm just going to start with the lightest one and I'm not sure how this one's going to look on me because I don't wear colors like this. So the first one I'm starting with is Secret Blush. So this one is very pink. I'm not used to wearing colors like this, but I don't think it looks bad. I think I'm just not used to it. They feel so soft on the lips. I am so happy that I decided to go for this line of lip gloss because I don't own anything that feels like this. They're not sticky at all. I cannot explain how amazing this feels. I'm gonna show you how easily they wipe off and then I'll just be doing the try on to make this really, you know, fast. <laughs> Here we go. This next one is Caramel Glaze. I'm also not used to wearing brown on my lips, but I think this looks really nice. It really reminds me of autumn, like a really natural, but like muted color on the lips. It's definitely nice. It's very different for me, but I really love it. This next one is Magic Hour, and this one I'm really excited about because it's an orange. Love that, absolutely love this. This is going to look great on Faded Clementine, I already know it. The fourth one is Moroccan Sunset. This is a darker orange. I love how unintimidating this was to put on. Like I just did a couple swipes and it looks really good, pretty vibrant, and I like it. I love having all shades of orange in my collection and this is definitely one that I don't have. It's almost red on my lips, but not really. Maybe it's because I'm a little bit darker. And this last one is Lotus Blossom, and this is a pink. Yep, what kind of pink is this? I don't know what kind of pink this is. Also, very different for me, but I don't hate it. It looks really nice. It's just a light color, so I can wear something like this. Um, maybe it's because I don't have on eye makeup, really. I just have on mascara, so maybe that's what's throwing me off a bit. But this is so nice, so pretty. Definitely more of a summery color for me, but I'll still wear it. I'm trying to get out of that whole, you know, makeup for different seasons thing, just wearing what I like. So I hope this video was helpful for you guys if you're wondering what these shades look like on a medium olive skin tone. If you're new to my channel and you just found me, I am doing Vlogtober and I'm uploading a bunch of videos this month, so you do have a good chance to get to know me. I have vlogs and main videos, just having fun, getting into the spooky spirit. So please subscribe if you want to see me next time. I hope you're having a magical day and I'll see you in the next video. So I technically already ended this video, but I forgot to try on a Faded Clementine. I just want to show you guys this adorable packaging. It's, I think, maybe the same size as the little minis. And I do like this formula because it's really smooth. It's not dry or matte feeling. So let's do this. This is perfect. It looks super vibrant on camera, but I actually don't have an orange like this and I've been wanting one like this so badly. So I am really excited. I'm going to be wearing this a lot this season and maybe for like the rest of my life because I love orange.